What's up, everybody? How's everybody doing today? We got a lot of things to review today, guys. Listen, listen. What's up, everybody? How There's uh, things we have to talk about here while I lower the volume here. All right. So, yep, yep. It's been a little bit of a, a fight. Bullish, bearish, a little bit of a fight. One keeps getting here, then the other one keeps hitting here, and it leaves us to figure out what to do. You know, sometimes there's a little bit of an inflation announcements and this thing takes over, which is the bearish move, right? And then all of a sudden it comes over here. Then all of a sudden things start re reversing because we talk about it and everything's going and then boom, we get the bullish. So different things happen, but now that inflation is here, we got to talk about how do we handle this? We want to be very, very proactive with this, okay? So it's very, very important. So we're going to review that today. Uh, other than that, if, if, you're, if you're live, welcome, welcome, say hello. If you're replay, just comment replay below that I know. So if it's not 2 p.m. Eastern, you know the deal. So I'm just getting everything loaded up here for us. And we're going to have an amazing time. If you're new here, if you're new here, I want to welcome you as well. All right. So if you're new here, uh, Kawika, Alina, Elliot, how are you? Hope you're doing good. Someone took, someone took my name. Yep, Elliot. Someone did take your name. So the, my name is Vlad. I'm the stocks to buy and why guy. I help you out to figure out what to invest in. The key here is letting us know what stocks you want us to review. Today, we're going to have a little bit of a lesson. How do we analyze the market first? So stay tuned. You want to stay tuned through the whole thing, okay? Because you're going to go over a lot of things. Any stocks you want us to review? I don't know if you saw the comments earlier today. Some people asked for certain stocks. Oh. Oh, yeah, I, I know. I mean, I didn't see that, but uh, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So we have a lot of stock. So if you're in here, I got a couple comments. I want to uh, I'm going to announce to you guys that people who ask for stocks, I just need to know you're in the building. So, for example, we have if you want to write these down, Joshua Warren, if you're in, let me know. I know you have five stocks. Uh, Mark Vanderreest, if you're in the building, say hello. I know you got a few stocks and Vic Castillas. So there's a lot of stocks here if you want to check those out. Uh, Sharon Harding, how are you? Brian Norris, what's up? What's up? How are you doing, man? Um, let's see here. All right, guys. So yeah, lots going on, lots to talk about. Um, oh, and let's smoke. get this going. What? <laughs> yeah, I know. Kavika, uh, you're welcome. Bob Benish, Bob Benish, everybody's in the building. Coach, doing some push-ups. Omar Abdul, what's up, man? How are you? I know you've been talking to some, uh, I think, Dave or uh, Anthony. And guys, if you're new, if you're new and you haven't received our webinar yet, we're going to break down stocks. It might be a little gibberish. You want to get our foundation. If you're in this live, it is totally free. Okay. All you got to do is comment webinar below and a guy named David or Anthony are going to reach out to you. They're going to DM you and take care of you. They're going to get you that link. So highly, 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 highly recommended. All right, cool, guys. So let's talk about the market first, and then we'll get into the stocks. We are hitting inflation. Inflation is a time where people are worried. Whenever there's any kind of worry, any kind of movement, I mean, worry will cause movement. So going to cause volatility. We want to make sure we're riding it the right way. That's the key here. That's the, that's the game we play. So when we look at SPY, this is the overall market, guys. And it's forming something that we've been talking about. It's something I said a few days ago. I felt like if we're going to get into something like a consolidation. So usually what happens in things like this is markets, when they go down, they create great opportunities. And if you would have saw a couple of weeks ago, I said, we're going to have some huge, huge opportunities. And we did over here. What happens is there's a little bit of retracement. So anytime the stock goes up, there's going to be time when it's going to calm down a little bit, sometimes a little bit more. And usually around 50% of a gain. So if I use this thing called Fibonacci, it lets us know that. Okay. So if you see here, boom, we got that going on here. All right. So that's showing me here that the stock fell to its 38% mark and it's kind of staying here. That's a popular move that right there. So if a lot of people are concerned, oh, what do I do? Where do I go? What's going on? Anil, what's up, man? How are you? Happy birthday. I heard it's your birthday. Uh, welcome, welcome, and happy birthday. I uh, hope we could go out for some chicken tikka masala. That would be great. Um, Srinath Shanmuganadan, 
Uh, Dean Berkey, we got, uh, so Dave and Anthony or Anthony will reach out to you. Guys, just a quick thing. If anybody sends you any kind of telegram until you join, that is not us. There's some scamming going on in our systems. We are trying to block them all. So please, please, please do not, if, unless it's coming from me, Dave or Anthony, do not click on anything, okay? Please do not click on anything to do with Telegram. Any kind of thing says, oh, I just talked to this person and they're going to make me money, money. Click on this person's name. Do not do it. Do not do it. I just, for your own good, guys, we don't want you to get in, uh, in any kind of issues. So please just ignore it. And if you see it, you could actually report it to us. We delete it as soon as possible. That's why you don't see them here for long. So yeah, the market is looking okay, guys. I like what I'm seeing. I think this is good. The key now is, is where do we get the opportunity? Well, we always talk about something called A to B, B to C, C to D patterns. What that means is when the, market, when the stock goes up, it never just goes up. It goes up, A to B, B to C comes down, C to D. And then again, A to B, B to C, C to D. It's a pattern, it's a pattern. We like patterns, patterns. So A to B, B to C, C to D. I could keep going. Even on the big, look, A to B, B to C, C to D. A to B, why am I doing this? I, I, obviously, I don't think anybody joined here to learn the alphabet. Uh, maybe Elliot did, I don't know. But if you see it, it keeps going. So when we have to, we understand that, we got to understand that the market went down A to B, B to C. Now it's kind of going into the C to D. So what we're looking for is the breakout of this. Couple things we could do here. Now, obviously we could invest now because there is some nice momentum, but it, we don't have certainty. With everything going on now, okay, we need to understand that inflation news is coming on Thursday. Mm -hmm. Thursday when we morning. Thursday morning. So if the in, inflation is coming Thursday morning, there's going to be rattling. There's going to be movement. We, it could go even lower because here's the secret to stocks. News equals gambling. You can't control the news. You don't know what's going on with that news, guys. We don't know. We don't know. So what do we do? We put our head backwards and we get it to work. You understand? We're going to do this right now, guys. So the big thing here is we need to get confirmation of the move. And I'm going to show you exactly where. This is the most clear and concise thing we're going to see. I'm going to zoom in here, guys. Okay, let's all zoom in together. There's over 40 of you in here, okay? So let's zoom in. Yep, I'm talking to you guys. You know exactly who I'm talking to. I'm talking to you, Thin Thai. Team Thai, you don't think I see you. I see you. Jamal Choice, what's up, brother? Brian Norris, what's up? Walter North, are you zoomed in with me? So let's look. It's very simple. There's two lines that we really have to pay attention to right now to really make a, a decision, okay? Number one is this 50-day moving day average. It's very rare when a stock is below the 50-day moving average and above 200. So it's in between. But here's what I'm going to tell you, Elliot. You ready for this? Are you ready for this, Team Thai? Lauren, oh, Lori Brock, what's up? How are you? <laughs> no, I thought Lauren. Rohit Duby, if it goes above this 460, guys, whoo, we got some coolness going on. And we are going to see another bullish run. The key to all the professionals that do this is patience. If you're trying to figure out the move now, you're in trouble, man, because you can. You might win some. And you know what happens? The worst thing that can happen to you is you win. Because if you went in a move like this, you took a good guess and you were right. And now you think you're an all-star. And then when you lose the next three plays and you're like, oh my God, I thought I could do this for a living. You can't, you cannot do it that way. So the first thing to do is before we look at this chart is if you haven't seen my webinar, comment webinar below. This will give you a nice explanation of how to use these moving day averages. Comment webinar below and we have Dave or Anthony send it to you out. It's no money, it's free. It's one hour long and it's full of knowledge. Anybody here will tell you that. So definitely recommend that. We like to give you knowledge. So if it breaks out here, we are looking at, if it gets to 465, guys, we're going to see some huge movement. If we see under 440, we're going to see some bearishes happen. I think my guess, we're going to see some strong movements coming up to a theater near you right after that conversation during inflation. Could be good, could be bad, who knows? It doesn't matter because we teach you how to invest going up, going down. And this group, the point of this group for us is to 
beat the market the right way and do what the professionals are doing that they don't tell you what to do. All right, guys. So before we go on into the actual stocks, we always do a little heart check. Okay, I'm giving out two free courses, our stock predator course that gives you a great breakdown of everything. I'm going to give our two courses today, but I need to see how many people are enjoying the show right now. Uh, it goes based on energy, goes based on content, goes based on, okay, not the face. Don't worry about the face. <laughs> goes on just engagement. It, I want to see if you could give us 250 hearts. You see how people are clicking on the hearts to the bottom right over here. We're trying to get 250 hearts, and then we're going into your stocks. If you're new here, again, comment webinar so we could help you out. Jason Berry, what up? And anybody who didn't say hi, guys, like Daniel Hackett, say hello, man. What's up? Austin Wright. You know, I could name all of you. Junior Johnson, you know, Darren Coles. I know you guys are watching. Nella Celeste, the Thai, still haven't said hello. Deepa Ch uh, Chagan, how are you? Okay. Um, so, yeah, here we go. So, we're getting some, uh, a little slow on the hearts today. And, guys, two things I want to, I want to see. If, hey, we got Lori going with the hearts. Dean Burke, I'm going to have to take a break. There's not enough hearts. My <laughs> voice doesn't work without the heart. So, and then I'm going to have to use this little just tea thing. It's really good, actually. Some little Wegmans drink. All right. Hello. Hello. There we go. Thank you, guys. Thanks for the hello. I appreciate it. Anshui, what's up? There we go. I, now I'm getting my voice back. More hearts. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. And one more time before we go. Um, before we go. We're not going anywhere. We're about to review a bunch of stocks, a bunch of opportunities. And this man's been working so hard, guys. This man right here. Give him some love. He's been doing so many lives, man. It's crazy. So if, if you're interested in dealing with him, we got some great coaching programs. If you're interested in one-on-one -on -one coaching, just comment coaching below and we'll do an, we'll set up an interview for you and see if you could be the person who's ready to do this and take some amazing men mentorship and a great network as well that comes with it. All right, guys. All right. So thank you so much for the hearts. Really appreciate it. Robert Smirk. With, uh, Smirk, yep. Yeah. What's up, Chris? Sure. Jeff Nowachik, if I said it wrong, please let me know. Austin Wright, what what it do? Nice. What it do? More hearts, <laughs> thank you. All right, cool. And Sharon Harding, I think I've seen you here before. You've been a, you've been consistent. Definitely, it will help you out here. Oh, please check Vladder. Is he trying to say my name? Is that what he's trying to it's say? Your, like it's your ticker. Yeah, that's my ticker, Vladder. Yeah, I like that. <laughs> you know, Vladder sometimes has a problem with the bladder, but we're good. Joel Bo Bel Panetta, what's up? Uh, I see he showed up and with the yo, yo, yo. That's what I'm talking about. Lori, thank you so much for your hearts. I'd love to give you a course, but you already have all our stuff. So again, and if you guys are interested in coaching, like I said, Lori is in the building here. She made a hundred grand in three months, 90 days with us, hundred grand. Never did stocks before. She was new. She was scared of what to do. She's like, oh my God, how do I invest? I don't know if I could do this. You know, I'm so used to doing something else. Um, no worries. If you're not, if you're new to this, no big deal. We'll help you out. It's my first time here. Pretty new. I need all the help I can get. Try to get money safe. Um, what I would recommend, Kawika, Kawika, I apologize, is uh, Dave. Dave is going to reach out to you right now, actually. Here we go. Yep. I just texted him to make sure to reach out to you. Uh, okay. So let's get this going. Let's get this going all right we have a lot of stocks to go over uh all right cool here we go huh what did laurie say uh it's my first time elliot is a yo thank you appreciate oh no no i guess i get nothing that's all good it's all good no honestly elliot is a good dude man all right so let's get into the stocks guys that's what we're here for that's what it's all about let's we have a huge list um, Omar, I'm also need help. I'm new and need this thing badly. No problem, Omar. Um, again, we're gonna, I'm gonna actually reply to you and I'm gonna actually put David uh, into this. So I'm gonna tag you into this guy. So that's me. So it's not fraud or anything like that. Sometimes we get some weird thing and I'm gonna put a few people in here because I wanna make sure. Here it's all good, and then um, add David. So there's a lot of people. If David, if you're in the building, say hello to people. And then um, David came in a little late. He was on a call before, helping one of our members out. So David, if you're in the building, say hello so people know who you are. And if you, he's gonna reach out to all of you in here. Let's go. 
Let's do the stock thing. If you're ready for the stock thing, we are ready. And we're going to talk about what? We're going to talk about the Bears. We're going to talk about the Bulls. We're going to talk about the Bears, Bulls. And we're going to talk about it all because it's time to get the clarity on stocks. They're not that hard to do. It's, e it's actually pretty easy. And I'm going to show you how easy it could be where you could read stocks in second. Let's go. CLF. CLF in the building. So CLF, so this is somebody who gave it to us. Yeah. Very interesting stock. I really like it. Uh, I could see it right from second. And when you get professional at this, we, after you take our uh, coaching, you'll see it gets pretty easy to read a chart. So right now the stock fell all the way down. It's just breaking some moving day averages, some good momentum going to it. Um, the one thing you got to look over here is the support line. And it, it's just breaking through that. Very nice. And the key I like is the nice momentum. The big thing I'm concerned is the volume. The volume is my concern here. Uh, I, I see the volume could be a little bit of an issue. So to me, to me, I like it, but I also think it's a little stretched from where it was because it was a big move. So I'm going to say no right now, but a huge watch list. It's a good pick. I like what you're thinking here. Uh, but I would say let's see if it could if it maybe either goes a little bit down before it goes up. Overall, I'm bullish on it. Or let's at least get to like 20, even 22 to be safe. That's what I would say. Because just because decreasing volume could trick you really, really bad. We fall in love with the wrong indicators, and that's that's what throws us off. Everyone in the Trader Foundation have been so nice and informative. Oh, thank you, John Mante. No problem. I really appreciate that, man. We really, really like when you uh when you talk, <laughs> give us sweet nothings. I like those, right? Uh, I'm really lost right now and don't even wear too much. I'm already a member. All right, we'll, we'll definitely help you out. Uh, I need to book up. Yeah, you need to book up a coaching session, Alex. That's the first step. Definitely got to get book a session with Elliot. Steve Blanton is watching. Blanton. Okay, let's get, let's get this going. Uh, Annie, A-N-Y. Annie. All right, Annie's looking to me like it's a um, kind of a, man. It's hurting this two hundred day. It's 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 rejecting this move. So it's just like a, a, in the NBA, we have the blocks. We talked about that before, and you know what happens. Uh, you know the you typical go thing. Layup. He goes for the layup, and as usual, I just and swat Elliot away. That's what the fifty day moving day <laughs> average is doing to this, and unfortunately, it's rejecting. It's a very cheap stock, very dangerous. Not recommended. Next. Uh, A-T-H-E. A-T-H-E. A-T-H-E? Oh, okay. A-T-H-E, again, also very cheap stock. Um, Just, you know, it's it's climbing. I would recommend not staying away from something like this. It's too cheap right now. It could have too much volatility, too many gaps like this. Could throw your account off. Don't recommend it. Where to next? Google with the L. Google with an L. Okay. Um. Sri Rant, uh, uh, I, I apologize, Srinath Shanmuganadan. I hope I said that right. If I didn't, I apologize. I'm just going to tag you to David just so he, because he just got here. So I want to make sure he he helps you out here. There we go. Okay, cool. Uh, Clove, I see that. All right, what's next? Oh. Huh? Oh, Google. Yeah, so Google is looking like, and this is this was a. Uh, you guys asked me about this before. I told you I wasn't a fan when it started here because it, it, it flew up, and I said, "Listen, guys, this is not a good situation." And was, since then, it's been going down because it was stretch. It was an earnings call. You know, this just happens. We want to avoid those. Stay away from this right now. We're still have so much uncertainty here. As of right now, it's still bearish. No sign of bullishness. I will say that if I looked at the Fibonacci and this one. Uh, it's just, you know, it's it's kind of in that 50% zone. I would like to see that 2875, 2900 to start investing it in again. Which and I was uh, you fun. Were you able to tag me to David as well? I, I think I did. I, did. I just did it again, just in case. You did? Okay, yeah. Help me out with those things here. All right. Uh, what's the next? Uh, David, if you're in the building, say hello to everybody. Fun with the PH. All right, P H U N. Um, okay, cool. Let's look at this, guys. Okay, so a couple things. Let me just look at this in, in one second. I want to point something out. Um, based on what I'm seeing here, so it's it's a little bit different here. So you could see it's been going into this motion and it's breaking through it now, but 
you know, it looks okay for a couple of days, maybe a run, but just be careful. Cause at the end of the day, this could jump. I wouldn't invest in this type of stock to begin with. So I would just be careful. Personally, I would just stay away from things like this, but it's not, not a bad move. If you want to take a little bit of a risk. I don't like those risks. What's that? I know they put in slots. Yeah. Um, Tesla. Uh, Tesla's looking like, okay. So Tesla is something. All right. So Tesla's going through a flag pattern right now. So you see this, this is called the consolidation flag pattern. And I think this is going to blow up and I have a good feeling it is going to go to the upside and you can see the volumes going down, which shows me the reason it's going down is, um, it's, you know, it's kind of like a good consolidation, but these momentums are showing pretty good. So if this breaks through this line, which is around 950, we're looking at a good move, guys. Great move. And, but we have to wait for confirmation. So 950 would be a good spot. If you want to be really safe, 1050 is the perfect mark. If it's a 1050, we are all in, guys. That's a good move. So but we have to wait. It's close. It's definitely going on the watch list. Uh, Jason Barry, I know I see Vladder. We're, we're going to get it going. Well, there's a lot of stocks in here. All right. So we're going to speed things up right now. NVIDIA. NVIDIA. All right. NVIDIA also is going through a flag pattern right now. Also going through some things. These are good stocks, guys. Put these on your marking right now because, look, this one has a nice pattern here. I mean, yeah. So we're looking to break here for, to, for safety. Shorter term play could be good too, bro. Could be very nice. So, we're, again, we're seeing the consolidation forming. Volume is decreasing, so it shows more consolidation. But this is going to the upside. I like it. If it breaks 260, I'm in. Next. Uh, Disney. I think they have earnings this week. Hey, guys. Sure. If, if, if Hey, Elliot, listen. Not everybody understands what we're going through. We're talking fast. So if you don't know what I'm saying, if it, you need a little more of a foundation, please, please, please check out our um, webinar. Check out our webinar. Check out our webinar. It's free. Comment webinar below, and David will send it to you. David or Anthony. What's this BAT Mobile? Huh? All right, we'll go into Oh, I see what they're talking about. Gotcha. All right, where's the next? Uh, Disney. I have earnings this week, I think. So Disney has earnings this week, so you got to be careful with that. Sometimes earnings could throw a stock off. Overall, I think the company's doing pretty well. A very, very similar, again, very simple here. Um, going through here. Yeah, so, uh, man, I would say right now, stay away from it. It's just too inconsistent. I, I, yeah, it's definitely a little inconsistent. So I would definitely check this out. Give me one second here. Let me, so let me look at all the other stocks. All right, guys. Sorry, um, Ellie had to go to the bathroom. You know what happens, gas. Uh, okay, Peloton. So I've seen people post about Peloton. I love this company. Unfortunately, bad things happen. Bad things happen. But what's going on with it now, right? It's beginning to show a little promise. One of the reasons is uh, Amazon was saying about buying them out. So there's a big move. However, this is very news driven, very news driven. So stay away from it. It's they Don't get into the hype. We need this to be something legit, even though it broke through it. Trust me, guys, it, uh, uh, it, it could be a good move if it happens. Usually announcements like this just give us hope and it's just fake money. The Amazon acquisition. Yeah, the Amazon acquisition. Yeah. Today. yeah. Yep. So then let's check out the that. next one. Um, All right. Amazon is next. Oh, it's ironic of both of them. Right. So again, Amazon, I mean, Amazon had bad, bad earnings apparently, right? Kind of weird, right? But I think it's because it's been doing so well for so long. It was in this channel. Whenever a stock is in like a certain channel like this for too long, it goes through the Netflix. I know did it. We learned that the hard way. <laughs> um, so yeah, so this one here, at this point right now, I would not invest in this at all, at all, at all, until it gets above the 200 day moving day average. You're just gambling. So until, if you like Amazon, good for you, nothing wrong with it. But I would say this is the line you want to uh, kind of look for because this breaks every resistance. I just wouldn't invest in anything. Worst case scenario, maybe around 3450 but $3,500 is like the perfect golden spot. Again, patience. We have a lot of stocks. If you don't have a good situation one, just wait for another one. And VAX. So we have a lot of stocks, don't we? Um, right, we have a lot. BLDR. 
VLDR, somebody who's been adjacent have been asking. Uh, okay, so VLDR, um, it did break through some things right now. So it looks very like a news driven stock. Here's what I'm worried about the stock. If you look, anytime it has these big moves, it falls quick. Mm -hmm. So this is just simply just, you know, and then you could see it went up and it just tanked. I don't like it, man. I, you know, wow. I know you keep asking for it. I just would not invest in this. I, I would be if lying to you it, if I options. told you I'd like it. Interested in it. Yeah, and it doesn't have options. It's just a, it's a very risky stock. Very VLO. risky stock, huh? VLO. What is it? VLO. Yep. VLO's, uh, VLO's at the very high right now. It's an all-time high. So what happens is again, eight. It's very. Oh, I thought it was one dollar. Yeah. It, so it has a nice pattern overall. A to B, B to C, C to D. A to B, B to C. It's a so based on this pattern, and it's always the same thing. One, two, one, two. It's ready to go down. I'm, I'm expecting this to drop to 84, 83 before it, it goes into anything. So definitely, definitely, definitely recommend that. Uh, David, I apologize. I know you guys keep asking me for David. I thought he's in here. Apparently he's not. So we have a bunch of people. David, say hello to everybody. We tagged you on a few people. Um, a lot of webinars to be given, given out. There you go. So that's Dave right there. I just like them. If he reaches out to you, guys, please. I would friend request David so you could see his messengers. Uh, he's going to reach out to you personally so we don't give out any personal information. And he's going to provide the link for the webinar, for the coaching. So, Dave, you have to go back to all the people here. And uh, ev everybody who commented webinar, if you want to say hello to Dave, you're more than welcome to. So he doesn't have to go search for you. Either way, he's still going to go look for it. So what's up, Dave? Love you, Dave. All right, cool. Did we just put him on sticky? Yeah, someone stuck him there. He might have did it. No, probably me. You pinned them. Yeah. All right. What's next? BHC. Oh, I don't know if I want to do that one. <laughs> I'm kidding. There's a lot of stocks, dude. Yeah. What B is it? BHC. All right. BHC. Okay. So BHC is also in a consolidation as well right now. So you could see here went up, went down, and now it's forming this flag pattern. The key is for it to see it break out. Okay. So I'm thinking uh, based on what we're seeing here, I don't know. It looks like it's kissing. Okay, well, you know, if, if you missed a couple shows ago, me and Elliot showed how we kiss with our uh, momentum indicators. Um, so yeah, right now it's kind of like it's kind of like a pecker, just a pecker kiss. Nothing crazy yet. We're still waiting for the big kiss. Um, I would say definitely want to see it above twenty six for us to invest. If it gets to twenty six, that's a good move. However, the big one, guys, is right here. If it gets to 28 and a half, invest, 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 put it on, put on a watch list and make it go. And if you don't know how to do a watch list, probably a good idea. Hey guys, let's, let's actually get on here. Let's talk. Uh, definitely check out the webinar, comment webinar below. And guys, as promised, I'm giving away two courses. Okay. Two courses here's, but here's the deal. I'm going to put a stock up. And you have to tell me, I'm going to give you a multiple choice. If you guess the right thing that I'm choosing, then I'm going to give you, I'm going to get you guys the course. What's the next one? You want to go with the uh, RCL special? RCL. Member, member given. Am I? This is a member special. Here we go. Ready? A, B, C, or D. Or A, B, or C. Do I think the stock, am I bearish on the stock? Means I think it's going down. Am I bullish on the stock? Going up. Or am I just neutral? Okay. Am I bullish? So I'm looking for whoever gets it right, gets the free five module course I have. That's really good course. Uh, it's going to help you out a lot. With, you know what to say? It's a $500 course. So I definitely recommend check it out. Um, am I bullish? Am I bearish? Or am I neutral? Am I bullish? Am I bearish? Or am I neutral before I review the stock? All right. Let's see what we got. What, who, all right, the Danielle says neutral. Okay, good, good, good. Let's see what else we got here. You think I'm bearish? Okay, we got two votes. Anybody else? All right, Robert Smirk. I will tell you this much. I'll give you a clue. The answer is already up there. All right. All right, guys, so I'm going to go over it. I, um, I am bullish on it. I am definitely bullish on it. So let's review why. And this is a little tougher. So if you didn't get the right answer, no worries. You know, it's, it's a, it could be a little subjective. So a lot of things here point out to me. A lot of things. I'm really liking this one. Number one, we got the kiss. Those are just the little things. We got the nice momentum on the stochastics. We got the right volume. 
Okay, now the other thing is if you look, we got this breaking resistance very close to it. And it just broke the 200 day moving day average. I really like this one. I'm very bullish on it. I could be wrong. If I'm wrong, then I should probably re re like refund the course, right? But I like it. I really like it. Now, do I think it's going to go up tomorrow? Maybe not. <coughs> Excuse me. Mm. You see, even though the stock's rejecting you. No, I think, I think it's a good stock. I think we're in a good position. You just got to give it some days to get it. But I really like this one. And you could even see just the overall pattern of this happening here. Um, I think this is just a nice channel to begin with. So, yeah, I like this one. This is going to be a big one for us. So definitely, definitely bullish on that one. So um, anybody who commented, both Robert, Anshul, you guys get it. Sharon, I think you already have, but if not, uh, David, um, can, you can you tag David on the ones? We're going to tag you on the ones that are going to get the course. Robert? Smirk, good job. Uh, Robert Smirk, I'm going to like your message. Ansho, I'm going to like your message. Uh, uh, Sharon, good job. Oh, Joel, ah, uh, you said bears. Close. Uh, Lori said neutral. No surprise. Uh, Omar, we got you as well. So we're giving you a five module course. Definitely check it out. I think you're going to like it. You did win. Good job on shoot. Sharma. All right. What's the next? M-R-V-L. Marvel? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I like Marvel. Uh, Marvel's looking all right. I really, um, so I like Marvel. I definitely like Marvel. I see that it's coming now to uh, definitely going to the right channel. Nice move today. I don't like the volume too much, but it's just really hard. So I'm going to say I like it, but you need a long-term trade. It's got to be a long-term trade. Long-term, long-term. So what I mean by that is at least a 40-day option just in case things happen. So if you don't know what I'm talking about with options, definitely check out the webinar. Comment webinar below so we could get that for you. Thank you, guys. Always great advice here. Hey, man, Robert, you know what? I like you for that. I appreciate it. We love com compliments. It makes me feel good in life. It means we're helping people. What's the next? AEO. AEO. You know, the more people join, the more stocks we have to go over, man. It's we're going to have to start having you go over some more of these, too. <laughs> All right, so over here, looks like it's coming down pretty hard. Um, not a fan of it right now, but if I might change my mind if it breaks this pattern here, which means it has to break 24. So around 25 is my entry point for this one, and then we're looking at some goodness, but it has to get to 25 first. Uh, what's next? And you. And you, okay, and you. Whew. This is new, huh? Yeah, this is very new. So new is new, and when new is new, uh, we don't really, you know, we, we try to stay away from it because there's, there's an identity crisis here. I will say this is very tempting to look at that because it, it, it just broke here. So this could be something I personally just say not to invest in it, as tempting as it is, because at any point it could just drop. Because, again, it's had big moves, and then it falls off. It's just because the stock is new. We're still trying to figure out where it is. The stock needs to be at least 200 days old for us to do anything. And you can see here, because of the MA that's 200, it says undefined. It's not even 50 days old. So I would stay away from this one right now. Let it form, unless you want to take some gambles. It's up to you. All right. Pipple. I mean, what was that? PayPal. PayPal. P Y P L. Pimple. All right. Pimple. Pimple. Yeah. As I said last week, I wasn't a fan of it. I think PayPal has been on a really bad pair down. I mean, it's just not having a good year at all yep, it's, yep, yeah yep. and it's just it's continuing going down so i hope whoever asked me a couple times they were bullish i told them i don't recommend it hopefully they listen if not you know then it's people what can i say it's people um all right guys quick uh, we're uh, we have a lot more stocks to do man but can i get let's see how many hearts can we get how many cards can we get in the matter of 30 seconds Okay, and if we get a decent amount, we're going to give it one more course. But we got to get a lot of hearts. Let's do this. Let's do this. All right. <clears throat> huh? There we go. We got some good hearts in here, bro. There we go.
All right. Thank you, guys. Marks. Thank you. Huh? Marks. All right. Let's continue. Uh, the way you just broke that one, that was pretty, I think, good. Short and sweet. Short and sweet. Let's and go. It, was, it, it got the job done. Yeah. Um, Cisco, CSCL. All right. Cisco is in a very cool spot right now. Um, oh, this could be a big move, guys. Hey, yeah, I'm talking to you. Nathan Claus, I'm talking to you. Nita Ormila, I'm talking to you. Davey Patrick, you haven't said hello. I'm talking to you. <laughs> Tanya Lewis, that's right. I see you guys in here. Raw hit, thanks for saying hello and giving us a bunch of work. <laughs> we, we put up a lot of stocks here. So on this one here, um, <laughs> looks like it's it's hitting this support line. And now it's also getting this resist little uh, consolidation going here. I like this. And... Who's it's coming close to this kissing point? Really nice, man. I really, really like this one. And it's coming up here and volume's coming down, which shows me a good consolidation. Thank you for all the hearts. I appreciate it. Thanks, Dave. I appreciate you saying hello. Um, you said hello, but Tone Sazo, Tone, Tone Suazo did not. Um, but yeah, Bob. So we're just waiting for this to break out. And to me, man. It's really going to depend on how that momentum's looking, right? But I'm going to say, I'm going to uh, guesstimate around 57-ish, maybe 58. Yeah. I think that's going to take off. Three of those. If, if, yeah. Think. If he gets above three, obviously 60 was, would be perfect. Yeah. But before that, I think so even 58 would be great. Definitely watch the stock. <laughs> What's up, Tone? Thanks for saying hello, man. I appreciate it. I like your name. That's a cool name. It's not Tony. It's like. Tone Suaza, like that's a person you don't want to mess with. <laughs> like if I said, bro, if you don't give me the right stock, I'm going to get Tone Suazo on here. Yeah, no, please. No, I, I don't mess with anybody named Tone Suazo. What's next? Apple. Apple. That is legit, man. That is a, one of the best things I've heard in a long time. Tone Suazo. Tone Suazo. Watch I'm out. liking the Apple, man. I'm liking the Apple. So it's Did really getting it? ready, huh? Would you buy it? Uh, no. Well, who Swazo? No, that. Oh, no, I wouldn't. I don't know. You're, I was talking Swazo. You asked me if I'm gonna bite him. Like like oh, I'm dead, man. <laughs> you don't mess with the Swazo. That's part of the you know some gang. I don't know what he's up to. <laughs> That's a crazy name. I like that it's floating above the fifty. I think it's ready to set up, and I could see this nice move here, man. I think this could be nice, bro. If this hits one eighty, guys, we invest. We invest. I'm really liking that for sure. Uh, so excellent, excellent stuff. Uh, sorry, Tone, I don't mean to pick on you. In fact, I apologize. Don't get upset. I, 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 didn't, I, I apologize. I, I think he's getting angry. And I don't know. What you going to do? What you going to do when Swazo comes for you? What's that? Uh, Ford. All right. Oh, I'm going to be stuck in that for a while. Ford is tone Swazo, Tone Swazo. What you going to do? Um... Uh, yeah, it's just dropping, man. It's the same thing I said before. It was naked when we talked about it before. Um, yeah, I know, Elliot. You should really put some clothes on. Um, but over here, I'm seeing, uh, man. Yeah, I just would. I would not invest in this one right now. It's in between two averages. It's just not a good, not a good situation here. Thank you for forgiving me, Tone. I appreciate. It. I get to live another day, my friend. Another <laughs> day, I will survive. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, so I would not invest in this. Too much indecision right now. These these candles right here are showing me too many uh, small dojis, they call them. So, and Tone, do me a favor. Since we're friends now, I need you to take care of somebody for me. Michael Weatherly has yet to say hello to me. So, we, you know, Super we got to figure out what's going on. He's in the group. He's watching the live. And he just won't say hello. You know, Michael, what's going on? Mr. Weatherly. But welcome to the club. What's next? HP. HP. HP, HP. All right. Um, so HP is, has been very bullish in this channel. That's good. Um, I don't know. I'm going to ask, uh, I'm going to use a lifeline on this. So what think, do you think? I, I think that candle right there tells it all. It's got that, that doji type of candle there. In the decision, doji can okay. Consolidating. All right. Let's see here. Break above 33. Uh-huh. Could see some more upside. Yeah. But to play to the upside, I'm saying 33. And it'll 30. probably be up to like 35. Okay. So you're saying get to 33 and then play? 
Yeah, with, the, with some strength behind that. With some strength, that. which right now we don't have in the volume. Right. Chris Lytic, how are you, man? I invested in Disney two weeks ago for the long term. You just said to stay clear. Uh, well, Robert, so here's the thing. Good, that's a good question, Robert. Uh, I don't talk about long term as much unless you ask me to. So this is the type of channel, like when we do our coaching sessions, it's a little different. But if you wanted me to look at it long term, let's do that, guys. Let's look at Disney. Um, I'm not saying it's a horrible place. But and when you're talking about the long term, I'm not necessarily hating it for the long term. For the short term, we need to see a little bit more action. I don't think this is a good, like, just to play for a few days kind of thing. But the long term, you you know, that's a whole different strategy. That's yeah. something we want to look at a little bit more. So if you look, for example, let me take a two-year chart, maybe look at something like that first. Um, I would say long, I mean, let's look at a weekly. Let's see here. Hold on. I mean, the long term, it's not looking that bad. So in long term, you're actually in a good position. I'll show you why. We, when we look mm -hmm. at a weekly, it's bouncing off this 200-day moving mm -hmm. average, and it's hitting these points. So there's no – I mean, this thing is very close to breaking 145. I think you're fine in the long term, only on a long term. So, uh, all right, cool. Hope that helps. Where to next? Uh, BAC. Was that Bob Benish? He was asked no, about BAC. I don't think it was this time. Uh, but, uh, yeah, stay away from this one right now, guys. It looks beautiful. I get it. Like Ooh. some of the stuff's looking good. Why? Like put it. Yeah, but right now it's hitting. It's the same thing, guys. I warned you about Google. Look at this chart for a second, okay? And now look at Google. Mm -hmm. Same thing. It hit this point right here, and it dropped down. So it probably had some nice earnings. It's already kind of an inverted hammer. If anything, I think we're going to see some downturn. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't bet on it exactly. But I definitely think it's uh, we have some some ways to go. C H H C H H. Let me see how many we got here. Are you serious? It's a lot, huh? Our uh, C H H is looking really good. Ooh, who gave us C H H? Fellow member. Her name is Gigi. If you guys want, uh, real quick, I'm gonna put in the word test in here. Actually, the word quiz. I just typed it in. If you guys want me to do one more quiz, like my quiz comment so I could see. If, if we get 10 likes, I will do it. So you see how I just typed in quiz? Three or plus thing. Yeah, no, the, I, that's fine. Rob, you're good to go on that, man. Don't, you shouldn't worry about that. So you, that, just so you're clear, a lot of the things I'm talking about are week, like for the week or two-week play. So uh, um, if you're interested, okay, I got one like so far, two likes, okay. So Brian Norris and Ash yeah, I'm sure of course you're gonna because you won, right? Um, so I'm gonna do it right after the stock. This one I'm very bullish on. I'm really liking this one a lot, man, a lot. So it's so many good things here. You're seeing it break every average. So this is a very good stock to me. This is what we like to see out of the numbers. Yeah, this is what I like to see from you guys. Uh, Kiho, what's up, man? How are you? Um, yeah. So this is a beautiful move. Just started to kiss. You know, I'm a big fan of kissing, and this is exactly what that's happening here. Beautiful move right to the top. Uh, love it. Love it. Great day to get in. Great day to get in. Do you agree? No, I would. Yes. No. no. I mean, no, yeah. No, no yeah, no, yeah, yeah, no. What, uh, what no. is going on with this guy? No, man? I agree with you. Yeah. Okay, so yes, no, he agrees with me, not agrees with me. Yes. No, I like it, really. No, it really is a good move. CHH, Choice Hotels, great choice. Um, Probably a good hotel, too. What do we got going on? I'm, anybody else, huh? So we got three people. Okay, so we're not going to do a quiz. We only got three likes on it. Unfortunately, I wanted to get 10. If we get 10, we do it. What's next? G5, G-F-I. G-F-I. What's this? All right. Should we do a quiz, guys? <laughs> Throw some likes at me. Should we do a quiz? Someone's interested in gold. All right. I'm going to do it for the four people. How's that? <laughs> four people. Some people don't like quizzes. That's Okay. Am I bullish, am I bearish, or am I neutral, which means unsure of this stock? Comment bullish. I'm giving away one course. Bullish, bearish, neutral. If you get it right, you get the course. What do I think of this stock? It's a tough one a little bit. That's like a big type of. Like Let's see what we're thinking here. Big wedge, yeah. All right, so Sharon says bullish. Yesterday was a good entry. I, get I don't know the difference to answer correctly. Hey, 
See, Carl, this is what I mean. I love, I love honesty. I love that. I love that. If I had to answer, I'd say bear. Is it bearish? Is it bullish? Which one's gonna win? Oh, um, we got a mix. Looks like right now. This is a little Neutral, tough. Bullish. Bearish. Yeah, this is a tough one, man. This is a tough one. Um, what do you think? I think. Uh, I'm just, I, I think you, you're going with uh, neutral here. I, I think you want to see it above eleven point four. At yeah. Least for I want to say bullish, but I'm gonna say neutral. Yeah. And guys, I can't even give away something. Oh man, it's a tough one, guys. Because I'm gonna show you. So it is kind of bullish because it's it's looking up, and we're seeing a kiss. But I needed to see, like you said, eleven point four is exactly what I think we need to be at for me to call bullish. Just because this volume is way too low, and that could cause some issues. <laughs> so, and again, the only reason I chose it because I love. As Hull, I hope I you know and like Ans Hull Ans Sharma so much because he keeps winning. But anybody who said neutral, great job, Davy Patrick, good job, Chris Glidick, everybody who said bullish, good job too, because that's a really tough one, man. That's the tough one. No one said bearish because bearish would be just no. <laughs> that's just the wrong answer. So everybody, it, it, I was in between those two. So if you're if you answered one of those two answers, it's pretty close because I'm very close to saying bullish if it wasn't for the volume. And we're just waiting for this to break out, man. So, James Satch, how are you, sir? Um, What's next? Team us. Oh, man. All right, guys. <laughs> I swear, me and Elliot, I have I messages remember. to prove it. I was talking to them about this. Yeah. I loved this stock. And I said, it bro, weekend, yeah. it was over. Bro, it was right here. I still remember. We could shoot, look it up the yeah, date, seriously. man. It, okay, I, it was either Sunday or Saturday. Sunday or Saturday. So that was around right we here. Did, right yeah. around here. I thought this is going to go, man. Right here. I didn't expect it to go that high. I didn't. I thought it was going to go up pretty high, but not that quick. And then this happened. Bro, did I call that one or did I call that one? He's like, oh, I don't know. I don't know. It's this or that. I said the only thing that stopped me was earnings. But yeah and it that's did fair good though, but it did it, good, seriously no it did really really good so and i apologize guys i didn't share this play on the live i should i usually do so my apologies on that one could you recommend an app or site to an analyze stocks please yeah i, I use stockcharts.com i really like it they have a free version of it so it's pretty good actually so it's clear it's understanding it, 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 it i noticed a lot of people have issues so we'll stop for a second and talk one of the biggest issues people have is they go and look at you know different people trading or they say oh check out my 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 platform i have seven different screens up you only need one man one of my good friends he's a day trader he's really good at it um he does very very well at it and he's he uses one screen 27 inch i'm like that's what it really takes so I keep it really simple so stock charts to me is simple it doesn't overwhelm the brain now some people what I've noticed in our course is people, people who take our course, they'll go through it and they naturally want to try to something else. That's fine too. You could explore. Stock charts is a great place to start. And if you haven't, uh, if you're liking what you're seeing here, two things. One, obviously comment webinar below if you haven't seen the webinar, but two, definitely check out the coaching. Um, we're doing, we look for 10 people every month. Uh, we still have some seats available. If you're interested in getting interviewed, we do have a waiting list for next month as well. If you're interested in coaching and maybe getting a mentor to really be able to change your life and use this stuff to, to be able to invest, if you'll be able to look at charts as quick as I do and say, yep, this is the way to go. And if you look at our winning percentage, it's pretty crazy, actually. So um, definitely highly recommend it, man. Highly, highly, highly recommend booking a call with us. Just comment coaching below. And we got one of our professionals, Dave Anthony here, who are going to help you out. They're going to help you out. All right, let's get back into this. LXP. LXP. Um, big rejection. Get it out. It's a big rejection. I would definitely keep an eye on it if it breaks through here. And part of the reason is the volume is so strong. Don't give up on it yet. Yes, it did get rejected, but don't wait for it. Uh, Bob Benish says coaching is priceless. He's actually in our coaching program. And I'll tell you something about, I learned something about Bob Benish the other day. Yeah. He's a, if you want somebody who pays attention, attention to detail, 
He took our course. He gave us some uh, advice on what we could do even better and things like that. Very impressive gentleman for sure. Uh, that's what you get for when, when you get an engineer in the house, man. But the, hey, Bob, thank you for all your advice. It was really nice talking to him, just helping us out, making things even better. And I'm glad you're one of our clients. Uh, Mike Gonzalez, what's up, man? I need to change my life to get better in my family to involve life. Oh, man, we, uh, uh, you sound like you're ready to do this, man. And so we'll definitely reach out to you. I promise you. I think Dave got you on here. And I see Lori liked your message. Lori was in the same ballpark as you. A lot of people were. So we'll definitely help you out. Um, I definitely recommend you book a call and uh, with David. And he's going to provide you all that. I believe he already messaged you personally. So, again, guys, if you receive any messages from our group who says, Oh, hey, guys. Uh, I, oh, hey. I, so we're in the same group. They're just trying to get something from you. Unless it's David, Anthony, uh, Ernie, it's I'm sorry, Anthony O'Neill, uh, Dave Gorbia, or Elliot, obviously, or Vlad, do not uh, respond because they usually try to take something from you, either your bank account or something. We'll never ask you to join a chat room of any sort unless you're joining a client. We're never going to ask you for your bank account. We're never going to ask you to trade your account. Nothing like that. You should never be giving out your credit card and messenger to begin with. Never do that. It's very unsafe. So just want to give you guys a heads up on that. You know, don't join any telegrams. Don't do any of that stuff. Do you know Anthony Ernie? RTX. Huh? Do you know Anthony Ernie? No, but that's his other name. Oh, uh, RTX. Yeah, that's actually his. Uh, I guess he doesn't go by that, but yeah. Um. Uh, yeah, so this one's already broken out. It's a nice stock. The problem is it's already so stretched out. Yes, it could keep going up, but we don't know how long. It's just a gamble at this point. Again, A to B, B to C, A to B, B to C, B to B, B to B, B to B. And right here, it's A to B, B to C, A to B. It's just a matter of time till it falls. You don't want to be part of that roller coaster. We don't know how far that roller coaster is going to go. Or to the AMD next and when? AMD. AMD is looking. Ooh. Nice one, NVIDIA. Um, uh, I'm liking this one, bro. Honestly, I really like this one for a few reasons here. You're seeing it, right? Kind of form this uh, part right here, but not fully. I'm going to tell you right now, if this gets to 140, I don't like it right now. I think because, ah, oh, man, it's a tough one, bro. You, it's a tough I, one. I feel like what you said about NVIDIA applies the same here. Like we got 140, right? Yeah, that's, that's yeah just be patient with this one, just because it already kind of went up, went up a little bit. What's up, Jesus Rivera? How are you, man? What's the next? Win with a uh, Y and I love that hotel. By the way, guys, if you ever stay at the Win. The best buffet I've ever had. Bro, <laughs> you bro, you don't, huh? <laughs> you it's huge. It has every food for every country. I don't know how they don't have ridiculous food waste. Such good, amazing. By far the best buffet I've ever been to. Uh, this one here. Anybody been to a wind buffet? Let me know. Um, This one here looks like it's ready to do something soon. We need to see a breakout from here. So we're looking at this point at 95. If we get to 95, I think it's heading to 100, but it has to get to 95. Otherwise, we're going to see it keep going. So this is beginning to form this consolidation here. So it's looking pretty good here. So just waiting for it to break through. Thomas Lannon, how are you? Rolando Javier, how are you? What's your next? Uh, I think that was it. Facebook. Facebook. Yeah, FB. Yeah. We got to start saying FB for that. Yeah. Uh, oh. Yeah. So we're on a Facebook platform. So we're going to say nothing but positive things about Facebook. They're a great company. They're so great that they actually like to dive. They go diving quite often. They have this diving board here. And then they go, ooh. Is this meta? It's meta. It's meta. Meta. Yep. So meta is looking really good for diving. Very good. If you're a diving professional, this thing is keeps diving to the bottom here. Wow, what a great diver this is. They, they, I mean, Facebook should join the Olympics. Um, the problem is when you dive, you kind of want to come out of the water as well. And there's just not much going on. So, again, guys, there's too, too many things going on with this company. Too much allegations, too, many, too much stuff. I would not do anything with this stock at all, at all. In the past, I loved it, you know, but for the diving competition it's having right now, you know, it broke this. It was a beautiful move. Gone, 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 gone. Um, again, I'm going to say invest in it because we are on it. But only if you like diving and it's because it's the Olympics. So again, we have a great algorithm for Facebook here. They treat us well. 
What's the next? Fun with the regular F. Uh, and they want to know if they should hold their put until it hits 54. Hold it. So they have a put. I have a put. They jump. In. All right. If they have a put, if they have a put, I'd say hold it. <laughs> I would say definitely hold it. It depends where they got it. But at this point, I don't see this lasting. And depending how long it's for, yeah, I would say definitely hold it for sure. What's your next? Um, someone asked about Matterport. Huh? Matterport. I forget the oh, M -A -M -T -T, M -A -T -T, M -T -T I yeah. MTTR, same thing. It's just called, and the stock just turned 200 days old. Happy birthday. Um, <laughs> overall, I'm not, not happy with it. It's way below its oldest average. So not something I would do. Somebody says mosaic. Yeah. Mosaic. Is that, is that MLS? Mosaic is, okay. So what is she saying about it? Um, Kawika Elena Elliott. We're not $20 in a year and how. Like, uh, oh, uh, Elliot said that you're because you have the same last name, last name, you have your first name. So, what would happen if you guys get married? Elliot, Elliot, that would be no. Oh, oh she'd have. Oh, no. you what if, I was gonna say my last name is Elliot. Oh, yeah, yeah, no, so nothing, <laughs> yeah, so it's just weird. If, if, if you were the woman, that would be weird, right? All right, well, don't don't be a woman when you're married, especially if that would be weird. Uh, Okay, cool. What if, if it's gone up, it's gone up to twenty dollars in a year in hell. Uh yeah, it's looking okay. Um, this is a tough one. It's a tough one here as far as I would say long term. I like it. Long term, I think it's pretty good. Yeah, I would. I would not get out of it. It sounds like it's a stock. It's pretty good, so I would keep it as a long term investment, not short term. Short term, it looks like it might take a little bit of a dip, a couple dollars here and there. And before it goes up, because you said it was holding, yeah, it did hold the twenty dollars, but it also had a dip in between. So short term, no; long term, yeah, absolutely. Uh, but I'm a, I'm a, oh, uh, uh, I apologize. Really, I thought I'm sorry, Kawika. Uh, my apologies. I'm sorry. If, I hope I didn't offend you. I really thought it was. Uh, it, I'll just shut up now. It's all good, man. Oh, I apologize. All right, but hey, sound, you know, two men. Is a it could happen. Right. It's one of those things that happen. <laughs> I'm gonna call <laughs> option. See now, now Kawika's upset at me. What's your next? Uh, CG. He I apologize, Kawika. <laughs> CG. He bought a call here. Uh, bought a call. I'm sorry. Where? He bought a call on that day, and Ooh. didn't sell it. Should they hold? Uh Once man, I, it really depends on how long. Thirty-four ahead. days left. 34 days left. Yes, hold it. And the reason I say hold it um, is because it's above this 200-day moving average for now. If it breaks this 200-day moving average, man, I would take a loss. Gotta own that one. You got to own that one, yeah, because then you're just hoping and praying. But um, I'd say you still have a ch good chance to rebound to at least like a 51, 52. Yeah. And if it breaks that, you could even make some money. But you got to be patient and you got to be careful. Once it starts getting into a two week thing, you know, it could be careful. You know, our teaching. So if I take me uh, getting married to Elliot, to me. <laughs> all right. <laughs> this is not funny. I'm trying to think like, do we want to set up a wedding? What do we want to do here? <laughs> Definitely a bachelor party. All right. We'll do a bachelor party for sure. I just want to see you name Elliot Elliot. I would love that. That was so cool. <laughs> But yeah, all, all right. So perfect. I'm going to say on that one, if somebody gave it a, a laugh, I'm going to give it a heart. I think this is this is time. So if guys, uh, we're going to stop the, for one second before we finish up here. Can I please get some likes if you want to see the two Elliots get married? Yeah, troll. All right. Yeah, if we could get 50 hearts, just 50. Oh, okay. Yeah. That just takes five times to press. Let's see who's your friend here. So we got some people comment, comment Elliot wedding below. I'm going to do it first because we could see the names of who's supporting you here. Elliot wedding. Okay. Who's down for an Elliot wedding? All right. Um, oh my God. All right. So Lori is all okay. So Lori, Oh, Lori said she's going to help you because she's, yeah, she does. Dress. a Yeah. She knows she has a good bridal <laughs> connection. She used to own a bridal business. So Lori's in. Brian Norris, you're coming to the wedding. Ooh. All right, Bob Ben. Is, he said he's gonna overanalyze your wedding too and make sure he, oh, everything's in the right order. Perfect, perfect. 
All right. Yeah, oh, that's comment, where, where my word sits. All right. <laughs> All right. Comment wedding below, and, and Dave or Anthony are going to send you wedding invitations to the to the Elliot Elliot wedding. All right. Perfect. Perfect. Oh, All right. I'll do <laughs> premarital counseling. There you go. Yes. Danny Patrick came out of play. Oh, all right. Goodness. I'm seeing is, are they trying? Is it, some people are like, oh, wait, webinar? No, 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 wedding. no wedding. Not the webinar. We want the wedding. All right. Definitely. All right. Perfect, guys. Elliot, Ooh. Elliot wedding. E, all right. Let's check out that stock. EEW. You guys are going to have your own stock symbol. EEW. Kind of, ew. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I just noticed that. Very nice, though. Very nice. So uh, we're going to have the mayor. mayor um, Dave. Uh, okay. Dave is ready. Dave is ready. Yeah, to, he's he's going to send it out to all of you guys. So um, we actually have a picture of uh, Elliot in a suit. I got to show everybody. Uh, <laughs> next week, if you join, I'm going to have a video of Elliot dancing. You guys got to see it. We just came from a wedding oh. from one of our uh, good cool. friends. Huh? Was it was great. Cool. He's a great dancer. Yeah. Let me, there's an Elliot stock. All right. Uh, e E W. Let's check that out. Is that a good thing? Uh, yeah, we're gonna. It's good. E, so yeah. once they're married, we will release the stock. E W Z. Yeah. <laughs> there is an Elliot stock. You see that? No shot. Watch. I bet you it's uh, Elliot wave pattern. Let's Weird. see. Let's see what this is. Yeah, right. but it's bullish. It's bullish. As soon as we started bullish. talking about it, it as soon up. as yep, it broke all the averages. And just so you guys want to see, I just want to make sure you understand. As I'm looking at the Elliot pattern. Look, they are beginning oh. to kiss. There's a kiss on the pattern, and the stochastics is fully erect. This is a great <laughs> stock. Everything's looking up for the wedding. So good job, guys. Good job. Very happy to see you guys. Congratulations. And you didn't even tell me anything about this. We could make it. Perfect. E O C W. E O C. Is that it? E O C W? No. Oh. All right, cool. Let's. Cool. Where to now? Oh, yeah, right, Lori? Lori saw you dancing. No, I saw, I got some good videos. I got the good stuff, guys. <laughs> All right, cool, cool. Well, congratulations. All right, let's finish up some of these stocks, guys. Where to next? Uh, Lucid. L LCID, I believe, right? Mm -hmm. Lucid is just doesn't want to break that part, man. I think this is going to be a good one eventually. Uh, very soon. So it's it's... Even though it's below its 200-day moving average, man, and the volume's kind of coming down, which shows me a really good consolidation. This is showing me some nice stuff. We want to see these lines cross. If they cross, woo, cross Alina cross is going to happen. Yeah, um, yeah, Lori, uh, I just got to get the okay but for uh, for the video. I, I can't just release the videos. I got to get the okay for myself and ask myself if that's what I want to do. <laughs> and I already kind of, I'm going to think, I'm going to give it a good think about it. I'll think about it. I thought about it. I'm going to do it. Just, if you stay tuned next week, there will Stop be a nice the, release. Stop it in the elite group. <laughs> if you're in our coaching, <laughs> if you're in our coaching program, you want to start the program this week. I will be releasing some, incredible videos that involves alcoholic beverages and Elliot making some crazy moves on the dance floor. It's coming to a theater near you only in the elite group. So if comment coaching below that where you want you, we will show you some incriminating uh, things on Elliot <laughs> and even teach you and mentor you on stocks as well. I was breaking up. What's your next? Uh, so, Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, Lucid. I like it. Um, I just think we need to wait and the right when this crosses. So I'm going to take a guess, just a guess. 33, 34 is the number where we need it to be for to see it reverse. 42 would be ideal. But again, now if the ultimate number, if you really want to get in on a short thing kind of thing is around here. So 42, 42, 43 is like a nice one. The wedding has to get me into the $500 seminar free. You got to have me. Mm -hmm. All right. You talking about our course, the course? Maybe we could do the course for you. That's right. I don't okay. know what he's right. talking about, Robert. Huh? <laughs> That's against the bro code. If Elliot isn't, wasn't toxic, it never happened. No, it never did happen. I never said it happened. It didn't happen here. But, the, you know, what stays in the lead, we know the deal. If it happened in the lead, it stays in the lead. The lead is a whole different story. What? I was that. What? It's Hawaii for David. So my name is David Elliot. 
bro, that means we have David and Elliot, the two people that work for me. This is That's this crazy. Is like, <laughs> the two people in this group there. So you could, you, I just need to hire him and I, don't, I, just, and I only have one employee. It's good. You're good for payroll, bro. <laughs> All right, Kavika, if you could guess my next stock, what I think about it, oops, then um, I'll get you the course. How's that? What's the next one? Um, I think that was it, honestly. All right, who wants to throw me one more? I'll pick a stock, random stock. Ready? It starts with A. A, Apple? A-L. A-L? A-A-L. Oh, A-A-L. Air Lease Corp. Interesting. All right, what do I think of this stock? Quick, guys. What do I think of this stock? Do I think... Do I think? Oh, that's right. C A H. I thought I had real. All uh, right. This is a good one, by the way. I'm gonna. Uh, uh, but let's see. Yeah, I don't know. Well enough to judge it, though. So. Um. Yeah, I like this one. I think you picked it out. It's a, so again. Uh, you should know this better than anyone, Mr. David Elliott. Um. Because there's a little kissing going on here. So. Um. And there's a lot of good moves here. Good volume. Great. Get, broke all the averages right now. I'm liking it a lot. I think it's breaking in really nice. Maybe, I guess, get to around here. If it gets around 18 and a half, even 19, to be sure, we're good to go. Yeah, Robert, I agree. Very bullish. Very, very nice. Um, histogram going up, plenty of volume. Yes, sir. <laughs> I agree with that, Brian. It's, it's typo took over right there. The 100% bullish. <laughs> Robert Smur, come on, man. Uh, no, he, now, Robert, bullish. are you talking about the uh, stock or are you talking about the wedding with that comment? I'm going to say bullish because the kiss. See? You see what you cause him? He, he watches you all the time. Oh, and, yeah. you know, things just happen. See. You're right. So I like this one. It's a bullish one. Uh, David, not uh, David, can you get David uh, Kawika Alina Elliott? the uh course please and we're, can you just go tag him on that or something um, C -A -H -H -A -H. oh look at ellie's gonna tag his buddy where is all right what's next huh there's some other um, ones right yeah yeah c-a-h one it was that one all right um yeah this one is oh this is a nice one too there's some good plays guys coming up we should really start looking into these Look at this. This is coming up nicely. We got, even though the volume's a little lower, I would say just because it's lower, maybe see it break through this. Yeah. So if it goes to 55, we're in. We are in. Yay. Well, thank you so much, guys. Uh, no problem, man. So David's going to reach out to you. Uh, it's not a flirt. He's just trying to get you some stuff. Thank you all for everything. Have a good one. Thanks, Brian. Always, uh, Brian's one of our consistent guys here. Definitely comes in all the time. And guys, so, and girls, again, if you're interested in watching the Elliot wedding, definitely let us know. But if you're new here, we are here just to give you an idea. Phil Holm, James Lewis, Anita Ormila, Sawani, Mathai. Uh, we got you on the coaching. All right. So if you're interested in coaching, guys, if, forget the coaching for a second. Forget coaching. Forget all that stuff. Don't worry about that. Let's talk about animals. You know, sometimes what happens is I love animals. As you can see behind me, they're great. I love to look at them. I love to see them. I like the bearishness. I like the bullshit. Animals are great, but I don't want to work like an animal. That's not mm -hmm. what I want to do. I want to be able to enjoy my life. And that's why I had to quit my nine to five, quit my corporate job, all that stuff. I was done with it. And that, and I've been training for a living and doing that. And then I decided, you know what? It's time for me to spread the wealth and teach others. I enjoy teaching. That's what I did. I was a, I was a, a director of training for years. So I know how to teach. I know how to create content. What we do is we make trading easy, okay? We teach it to you in a lot slower fashion, but not too boring. I don't think, you know, I'm not a big boring person. So you'll be able to understand everything or we just give you your money back. That's how we have a very good guarantee for what we do because we are all about results. So if you're interested in coaching and the only thing that's stopping you is maybe the finances, if you're stopping because of the finances, guys, it, Maybe you can't afford it, but maybe you can't afford continuing the way you're living now. So we, what we did is we created different plans, more affordable plans. The least you could do is get on a call, figure out if this is for you. If you're not, if you're not interested in changing your life, maybe you like where you're at. You don't need stocks. You don't need anything else. You're happy with working for someone else. That's fine too. Then you don't have to do that. And, um, so we're going to take care of that. 
comment coaching below and just have a conversation with us. Nita, I see she wanted to get into the coaching. We're going to definitely help you out. Um, and if you're just kind of getting into this and you just need a little bit of clarity, comment webinar below so we could get you the webinar. And David's going to send it to you so you have some clarity on what you're looking at to see what we do, how we do it, and get a strategy out of, out of it. Six simple steps on how to trade one of my famous balanced profit formulas. Uh, yes, please. Which one is which? What do they mean? What is he talking about? Um, not sure. Which one is which and what do they mean? Are you talking about the animals? Uh, bear means bear is going through. Bull means bull is going up. But combine, combine, they form Elliot. Now, the big thing is, the big thing is, you want to make sure you don't become an animal, okay? You do not become an animal. We're human beings. You want to work, you want to live your life on your own terms. That's uh, Brian Steele. We could call you today if possible. Yeah, I think I'm going to see if, um, you know what? Can you do me a favor? We're going to tell Dave. I'm going to make sure he has time. If not, we're going to give it to one of our, I don't know. I want him to have Dave for sure. We're gonna, I'm going to say make sure that we have somebody for you. You've been joining us a lot here. So I'm going to make sure, um, I get somebody to reach out to you today, David, okay? I'm just gonna call it like this for myself. Anybody else who wants to call, let me know and I could see if I could prioritize because I know the next few weeks are a little bit crazy. Um, so yeah, again, guys, don't become an animal. Enjoy your life. We only have a certain amount of uh, time to live, right? The, the last thing we want, we don't want is for you to be 70 years old having regret of, I could have, should have, would have, when, trust me, I lived that life. And even if you're making a lot of money, I was doing very well at my job. I didn't complain about the finances. It was the stress, the burnout, and every day waking up knowing I'm leaving my daughter. I hated that. Hated it, hated it. I hated traveling. I hated, I hated my boss, man. Ooh. He gave me the, I don't know, this feeling. Oh, it's called anxiety and stress. And oh, it was just leading to a bad place. But yeah, so if you're interested, my job right now is just to help as many people as I can. I know it's hard out there, especially with the stock market. A lot of scams, a lot of fraud. We have a lot of stuff going on in our group that's freaking join my telegram and we'll just give you all these magical plays. And then the, most of our calls are that. People are saying, I went into this group. I did all these calls. They gave me all these magical indicators and I lost all this money and they don't all talk to me. And it's not because they're bad people. It's just you need a person to break it down to you on a fundamental level. Anything you're good at, if you think about it, just think about whatever you're good at in life right now, that you're the master. Think, take that thought. Take that thought. Take that thought for a second. Some people are good at marrying other aliens. Whatever you're good at, think about when you first started, you probably sucked at it, no matter what it is. Somewhere along the line, you built a skill for it. You took time. Somebody mentored you. Somebody, or maybe you had to go through struggle. Maybe you had to go through failure. Our goal is to make sure to give you mentorship, which is the cheat code to getting you to success faster. That's why when we do our coaching, we do have a money back guarantee to make sure if you do everything right and it's not working, something's wrong. Something is wrong. So we're going to analyze everything. Make sure you're doing all the steps. Make sure you do all, you just have to follow the steps. That's it. The number one reason people fail is because they don't follow the steps. They get cocky. They win so much and they're like, oh yeah, this is easy. I got this. And they forget the basics. So we'll give you the basics. We'll give you everything. Plus, you're going to get a family. We've got people like Lori, Leo, a huge group of masterminds who have followed the same philosophy, and they get together all the time. I think they're even doing their own Zoom now, right? Yeah. They created their own Zoom just to go over place to set themselves up for the week. And it became, it's literally a family. I don't even get involved with that. They just created that. They're doing their own thing. And it's amazing. It's amazing to see people just help each other out. They don't get paid for this. Everybody thinks Leo works for me. And <laughs> Leo does not work. He's just there to help each people out because Leo's successful. And sometimes when you get to a certain level, you just want to help. Contribution is big. In fact, Alonzo Diaz is in the building. He'll tell you that's Leo's cousin. And he's actually one of our elite members too. That's what I need for real. Oh, well, listen, you, you need to save up for a wedding, but my friend. <laughs> Thanks, man. I have, I have to get okay guys really appreciate everybody here man or seriously we're going to be back here thursday with more plays we're going to see yeah, thursday's yeah, going to be yeah. interesting because thursday here's the deal for thursday 2 p.m eastern we're going to be back here we're going to talk about how did inflation affect the market 
And we're going to see some great plays up or down. There's going to be some volatility. I'm very excited to see dun, dun, dun. where is it going to go? Interesting. It's interest time. These, these are the times that we come out and attack mode. All right, guys. He is an awesome person. I agree. Thank you, Davey. Thank you. Hey, anybody who I, uh, and, and let's all thank Kawika Alina Elliott, also known as David Hawaiian, um, that uh, let us play with you. And, uh, you know, obviously we, we crossed some boundaries with you there. So I appreciate you being cool about it. Some people get a little offended by it. So uh, thanks a lot for being such a good sport, man. And we'll definitely reach out to you for sure. Uh, yeah, th Thursday's going to be crazy, man. Thursday's going to be crazy. Tell your friends to join uh, this group. I think it'll help you out. All right, fellas. Absolute pleasure. Thank you so much. Thank you every single person who took their time out of their life to watch me go crazy, make fun of everybody. Just have a good time. Hope you learned a little bit. Again, if you're watching the replay, thank you for watching the replay. And I'd love to just see your information. I always go through them. Comment replay below that I know you saw it. And if you, or comment a webinar or coaching now, because I look at the end to make sure I, I uh, we provide you that information. Love you all. Thank you. I will see you on 